personally um, had such great experiences with Matt, uh -huh. and he was someone that cheerleaded for me and supported me. Former co-anchor Ann Curry, who was famously ousted from the Today Show, told People magazine she's still processing. The battle lines are now clear. We need to move this revolution forward and make our workplaces safe. Corporate America is quite clearly failing to do so. And unless it does something to change that, we need to keep doing more ourselves. While so many are voicing support for the victims, others are offering compassion for Lauer. I don't feel that Matt has betrayed us. Mm. I texted him this morning and said, Not, I adore you. Mm -hmm. and, and, and no person is perfect in this world. Nobody is. Mm -hmm. We've all sinned and fallen short of the glory of God, is what scripture says. Yeah. Today in that Variety article, three women coming forward as victims of alleged sexual misconduct by Lauer. These are very serious allegations and very sensitive material. Elizabeth Wagmeister is one of the writers of the report. When the Harvey Weinstein story broke, of course, a number of names came out, and we just kept hearing, you've got to look into Matt Lauer. Of course, rumors have followed Matt Lauer for years. There's a lot of tabloid reports about his behavior, but we heard that it was a bit deeper. The Variety report states that Lauer's alleged misconduct was not a secret among other employees at Today. Several women told Variety their complaints to management about Lauer fell on deaf ears. In response, NBC said, we can say unequivocally that prior to Monday night, current NBC News management was never made aware of any complaints about Matt Lauer's conduct. 